opened a brand new generation of Pokemon cards, Scarlet and Violet base set for the very first time. And now today we're going to be opening the brand new Elite Trainer boxes that Pokemon has completely changed, making them better than ever. The moment of truth. Let's see what our promo card looks like. Woo! Oh! Oh my god, you got a banger hit. Pulls are non-stop in Scarlet and Violet base set. Oh my god, the hits don't stop. Boyd is actually fucking... These are the brand new Scarlet and Violet Elite Trainer boxes, and I'm more excited than ever before because they now include different things such as promo cards, more packs, and even more goodies inside. I'm so pumped to open these that I don't even know which one to begin with, but what I do know is that I want to give away two ETBs to two subscribers here on the channel. You can choose either Scarlet or Violet, and if you'd like to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. All right, so here we have it, the Scarlet, also the Karyodon artwork on here, and then the Violet, which is also the Mariodon artwork. I think I want to just start off, I decided, with the Scarlet box here, and I just have no idea what to expect out of these. They're completely changed with a ton of different things. I know they increased the price of these a bit, so it's interesting because, like, you also do, like, the price increases, but you also get more stuff in there, but we'll have to see if it's actually going to be worth the increased price tag or not. This looks really nice with the gold and red. It really pops, but let me pull this to the side, and then here you go. You have the player's guide in here, which we did look through one of these yesterday, but it basically goes through all the different cards, the rarities, and all that stuff that you can pull out of this uh, set, which there's still so much more stuff that I want to pull out of here. It's kind of crazy. All right, but it's time for the big reveal. Let's see everything that you get in the new ETBs. All right, but I think we should start in the middle here. And it looks like they did keep this whole new design thing. I like this a lot. It's just kind of like sleek. And then you have your little status counters in here, which is pretty cool. So you have that. Uh, then you also have the dice. Okay. Oh, they got the EX one. And it's red. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. All right. Let's 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 check them out. Let's check them out. Okay. Let's see what I roll. Oh, five. Not bad. Okay. Uh, so, like, this is red and it has EX on there as well, which is pretty sick. It's kind of like jelly kind of clear a little bit which is pretty nice all right, all right let's let's keep going so on the one side now you either used to get eight or ten packs and this is different because you have nine i believe so it should be one two three four five six seven eight and nine so we do have nine different packs okay that's nice and then let's see what else we got we got to see the sleeves all right come on sleeves there we go okay three hours later Ooh, nice so we got that gold oh the gold on the back too okay Let's get it. Let's see. Let's see. So you got that gold on the inside there, and then you have the red on the back, or on the front, I should say, or on the back, I guess. The back, realistically. Uh, but that's your sleeves. Okay, nice. Yeah, we still have, like, the, the clearer version, or not the clear version, the cloudy version of the sleeves, which I'm not a huge fan of, but we'll take them. And then let's see. Oh, yeah, I forgot. There's a promo card. That's going to be crazy. The promo card is different depending on if you get Scarlet or Violet. So one of these ETBs might actually end up being more expensive than the other because, like, there might be a uh, promo card that people want to collect more than another one. But here you have the dividers also look pretty. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Okay. If you want to get fancy, you switch it around here. If you want to be more casual but still pretty cool, you flip it that way. Back and front. Interesting. I like that. Then we have... It looks like it's all going to be energy, but since this is the first time we're opening up something like this, let's just double check to make sure there's nothing hidden. Ooh, okay, let's, let's just double check to see. I don't know why there was like a uh, fingerprint on there, but let's see what, what uh, well, yeah, it's all going to be energies. Okay, I could have guessed that, I guess. And then what else? All right, so we have the code card. This is Scarlet Violet Elite Trainer Box, Cryodon, and then the moment of truth. Let's see what our promo card looks like. Back looks pretty solid off-centered a bit that's fine i just want to see the artwork <laughs> yo yo you get it's crazy it makes me want to like open etbs more than ever now because you get a freaking promo card if you guys didn't know back before you only would get promo cards and etbs for special sets it was a pretty rare occurrence because there's not a ton of special sets and i always said you can go watch rewatch some videos and maybe try to find where i said it but i always said they should have promo cards in every ETB. It shouldn't just be a special set because I would want to open up ETBs more than ever. And now I really do. Oh, my God, because it's also basically uh, illustration artwork. It looks so sick. The Karaidon sleeping there on the rock. Oh, my God, like over that whole jungle scene or whatever. That is amazing. Then we can see on the bottom here, it does have the Black Star promo number 014 with the silver borders. 
pretty amazing. But all right, let's open up our nine booster packs from our Scarlet Box, and let's see how we do on our... What is happening? Dude, we opened booster boxes and they didn't have white code cards. What? Now there's white code cards in here. Scarlet and Violet, what is happening? Hold on. What? This should be an energy. There were no white code cards on the base set boxes. Was that a, did they mess those up? Oh, that might be, that might be something to look at. I hope that they're not like weighable because then people are gonna be like weighing those out and stuff. Ugh. Okay, Toad School, Shup It, and then we do have our Hollow. So they're considering, this is like the lowest tier. It's two rare, two reverses and a Hollow. And that was a white code card. Dude, they might have messed up on base set booster boxes and made all them black code cards. The thing is, the code card color is a white one again. The color is actually of the code card. It's going to make the code card either lighter or heavier. So that would make it like way more difficult for somebody to go through and like weigh packs. Uh, that could be a mistake because I did not get a single white code card on that booster box that we opened up yesterday. But then we have a hit in this one. What is happening? Iron Treads now. Bro, I don't know what's happening. Iron Treads. We pulled this one before, but I'll take another one. Uh, don't know what's happening. Just going to keep going and moving along here. What is happening? I don't understand why. That's a white code card again. That's a white code card again. Is Pokemon doing all right right now? <laughs> what happened? There must have been a miscommunication. Somebody was probably working and was like, yo, so we're doing all black code cards? And they were like, no, no, we're doing all white code cards. Uh, don't know what that means at all. Oh my god, what is happening? Dude, they might have messed- wait. Did they put all black code cards on the booster boxes and then, and then all the white code cards on the ETBs? Slowpoke! Skiddo! And then a hollow- I don't know what's happening. I'm very nervous. I mean, like, there's been some changes here with Pokemon doing a lot of- They probably have to change so many things with the production and all the stuff, but like, somewhere they might have messed up a little bit. <laughs> that's- that's kind of weird. That's kind of weird. Um, okay, Heracross. Unless it- Oh! Oh my god, the double gold star rare! Dude, the secret illustration of the special illustration pool, baby! That is the Iron Treads EX! And new pool for us, and it has a, such a cool pattern on it! Um, and that was- Dude, I don't know, the code card was definitely a white code card. And we got a banger hit! I noticed the quality is all over the place, because this one looks really good. Oh, it's actually off-center. But dude, check that out, that's the double gold star on the bottom there. Seriously, like, really nice texture on this thing. But I don't know what's going on with the code cards. If somebody finds anything out, let me know. Because now I'm just completely confused. The code cards... What are the, what do the code cards mean? <laughs> oh, we got Case, the Viper, Meowth, Karada. But anyway, yeah, if you missed yesterday's video, make sure you check that one out. The Scarlet and Violet box, all the code cards had black borders. These all have white borders. Don't know what's happening. But what I do know is this set is pretty fun to open up because every pack has stuff in it. A bunch of different things. Mariadon on this one. Interesting pull so far though. We did get a special illustration which is pretty tough to pull. I was pulling those one per booster box and which has 36 packs. This has nine packs and we got one. We got one EX. Definitely think we can get something else. Let's see. No indeed. I don't know if I'm ever gonna get used to having just an energy at the back now. I just don't know if I can. And these packs feel different, by the way. This is definitely like a different factory. These feel like thicker. The other ones felt a little thinner, a little bit sleeker or something. I don't know what the right word is. But let's see what the last pack is on our Scarlet ETB, and then we're moving on to Violet. And, oh, wow, I can gamut, but that's oh, just two hits, but one was really nice. Wait a second. We interrupt this program to let you know that the official Pokerep packs are in stock now. But here's the cool part. The Mega Bonus Pack, which could be any pack as old as the original 1999 base, all the way through to every single generation of Pokemon cards ever made. You'll have a shot to pull any of the four tiers, which are colored accordingly to the rarity. To start off, we have the lowest tier, which is the green tier, and that gets you another Sword and Shield Pack. The next step up is the red tier, and that gets you any set from the Sun and Moon or X and Y era. But keep your eyes peeled for the silver tier, which can get you any set from the black and white era of Pokemon. And finally, we have the gold tier. That gets you anything from the original Wizard of the Coast era, such as Base Set, Jungle, Fossil, as well as the Heart Gold, Soul Silver era, Diamond and Pearl, Platinum, and more. And as always, odds are listed on the back packaging so you know exactly what you could pull. You can grab your Pokerep packs at thepokecape.com, but make sure you grab them soon because we have a hard time keeping them in stock. So click that first link down below in the description. Alright, it's time to show Violet a little bit love here, and we are gonna see 
exactly what we get in here. We're going to see that the uh, there's a different promo card in here. So this is not going to be the same. All, all this inserts, the sleeves, all that's going to be different. And literally even the promo card, which is a first. Anytime we've ever had different artworks on ETBs, the promo card is always the same. Uh, and the promo card, it's always just been one promo card. Yeah, I'll show you this really quickly. Here's the outside of the player's guide. Let's pop the top on this one. And now we are greeted with different vibrances of purple. So let's see what, if we got all of our nine packs here. It seems like we probably do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I feel like, I really feel like these feel, these packs feel way better than the ones from the booster boxes. But I don't know what's happening. Everything is kind of, they're, they're kind of messing up, dude. I wouldn't be surprised if something with weighing these, with weighing this sort of like set, it comes into play at some point. But here we go. So we have like the same style of um, our dice and stuff like that. But this one we have the purple. Okay, very nice. It has the EX on there as well. Switching it up with the purple. Okay, so let's see what else. Let's, let's check out the sleeves. Can I get them out this time? Not too bad. We got our code card, Scarlet Violet Lee Trainer Box, Maridon, and there we go, the Maridon sleeves. We'll take one out just to take a closer look at them. Um, but here we go. The Maridon looks, I mean, it looks really good. The gold outline, simple. It just pops nicely. All right, let's keep going. So now we're going to get our dividers, if I can get them. Come on, buddy. Come on. All right, I got them. So we got our dividers, but if you want to get fancy. Ooh, look at that. That looks, that is sick. That's actually sick. Okay. Really good job on the design of these. Everything looks pretty sleek, pretty nice. Contrast nicely. Let's grab them. Okay. Energies, don't care. We already saw those. Um, and then I think the only thing left is the promo card. Okay. Here we go. Let's see which one's cooler. They're probably both really cool. But let's see. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. Just dropped it. Okay, we have Mariathon. Oh, dude, that looks sick. Yo, that pops. Hold up. Hold up. Both are really good. Both are really good. Oh, my God. The Mariathon illustration artwork looks amazing. Wow. It, the, the moon in the background is actually ridiculous. It's like pink. And then this is number 013 on the promo card. The other one was number 14. Which one do you guys like more? Let me know. I don't know if I could choose, honestly. I like the color. Uh, Maybe the colors are kind of, I like a little bit more than the Maridon. Cry I don't know. They're both really good. I'm not picking. But here we go, back with the white code cards. Something I tell you, there's gonna be some there's gonna be some some somebody's gonna be dropping videos or something and investigating into this stuff. Oikaloin! Dude, the double silver rarity or the double gray star? That's sick. So that is a, an ultra rare, right? Yeah. That is a full art. Dude, I'm telling you, I think I, I think I'm gonna do I'm gonna I'm gonna try to complete this set. I wanna do a stream. Because I feel like I can complete this set. I feel like this set is definitely gonna be easier to complete than uh, than any of the other sets from the uh, Sword and Shield era. Well the main series sets anyway. Quackavel! Toad's cruel! Oh my god, the the hits don't stop! We got the Mariathon Gold! Dude, I've literally pulled almost every single triple star rarity card out of this already and i've only done two booster boxes and now two etb the pulls are non-stop in scarlet and violet base set that's it like the pull rate is actually fire i think it is not going to be a problem at all to pull all the gold cards out of the set there's six and we've pulled so many of them already out of only a few products the special illustrations i pulled oh my god the special illustration i already pulled three of the ten um the regular illustration cards i probably pulled almost half of them i would guess Mariadon! 100%. 100%. I'm calling it now. I don't care. This is going to be way easier to complete than any of those other sets from Sword Shield. Evolving Skies, all that stuff. No way. This is going to be way easier. I don't. It's, I am calling that now. I am so sure of that. Crocolore, Chansey, and a Slowbro. Maybe this is like the new balance of like completing sets realist. Well, still, it's still not easy. I'm not saying it's easy. I'm saying it's way easier. Already, but from. Going off of like literally impossible to like <laughs> still pretty, pretty tough to way more realistic. Let's keep it rolling. All right. Come on. So far, um, yeah, the hits have been actually pretty even between these two boxes, I would think, right? Yeah. I think pretty e uh, Well, this one was technically a secret rare, I guess. Yeah, Karata. Wow. Okay. If we get one more big pull from this one, I would say this has the better pulls. The illustration rares are freaking amazing, though. Okay. All right, let's keep going. I don't know what's considered a secret rare now. I don't really know. Houndor, Fido, reverse. Literally a dog made out of bread. 
Toxicroak EX. All right, I think this box has the better pulls officially now. We got the EX card. All right, two more booster packs here. Come on. All white code cards. Very strange. Let me know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think anybody knows yet what's happening. <laughs> I've got to say, I think that's a mess up it's some or something. Spring of the oh, my God. Yo, the pull rate is crazy. Mariah on EX now. It's full art. Bro, we got both versions of these. Actually, we got three crazy Mariton cards if you include that. Bro, the lineup on this. This ETB crushed it. This Violet definitely, definitely had the better pulls than Scarlet on this one. Oh, man. Okay. So the cool thing about this is it's like the pulls are throughout the entire set that you're getting. It's not just from like a trainer gallery or something like that. It's all throughout this set. You're getting all different tiers and stuff like pretty consistently, which is nice to see. And a Skeletor. All right, so what I'm going to do is two more Elite Trainer boxes worth of packs here. So it'll be uh, 18 more booster packs total. All right, Scarlet packs going in first. Let's see what we can do. Quexly. Let's go. So, yeah, we got to open up more packs. We just got to see some more of these pulls. Because, like, there's just so many good cards in there. Not going to lie. I was a little bit nervous with Scarlet and Violet. I wasn't sure how good the set was going to be. Didn't know. I mean, you didn't really know a lot going in because you didn't know what to expect. Because everything is just changing. The borders, pull rates, rarity types. Everything about this. We got a bayonet. Yeah, this is the only thing though. I'm not I'm not a big on how the EXs are looking. The quality on the EXs look really dull. Other than that, that's probably the only complaint I have. Some of the quality control issues on some of these cards too. Uh like centering has been big issues. And uh then the code card thing I am kind of worried about, to be honest with you. Uh, that might have been a big mess up, or it could have been how they wanted it. I don't know. Hallelujah. I'm sure people will investigate it. <clears throat> and I can't be the first one to uh, have realized that because if anybody's opened this up yet, I'm sure other people have noticed as well. We got King Gambit. All right, starting off a little slow in the Scarlet Packs. Starting off a little slow in the Scarlet Packs. Everything's a white code card, though, apparently. Whatever that means. Okay. We got Professor's Research. Oh, my God. Dude, this ETB now. Uh, did we push all the luck out? <laughs> this ETB only got one, <laughs> one Bayonet EX card. That's not a good start. Houndstone. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm sorry. This ETB though. This ETB. This just might change up my, my whole outlook on the set. Pull right. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. All right, this is a roller coaster. One pull. One EX so far. Yikes. That's all way worse than the first two. Maybe, maybe make up for it. No, cloth. Oh boy. Okay. Ugh. That was the worst ETB by far. Unless this last pack has the best cards. Double banger. Let's see what we got. We got... Oh, oh, oh my god. <clears throat> uh, we're not going to talk about that one. That was the worst ETB. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow, that was bad. Some, I'm sorry, Scarlet. Let's see if Violet has the goods again. Mariodon. Well, I guess nothing's guaranteed in these things. I wasn't expecting that to be, but... I mean, the other two were just ridiculous. So let's see if this one is bad too. Come on, can't be bad. Fue Coco Halucha. There's no way that this can be worse than the Scarlet ETB. All right, let's see. It's Poke Gear 3.0. Hypno. Oh no. Still not used to how these are set up, by the way. I think it makes sense to just go straight through and then show the code card at the end instead of pulling it out. I think it's probably. Oh, there we go. This one's already better. Toxic. I this still pulling stuff that we haven't seen yet. We got the Toxicroak EX Ultra Rare. All right, that one, that literally just made this one better. Higher rarity, that's a two-star rarity right there. The two-star, I don't know if it's supposed to be silver or gray star. I think it's like silver. The worst case, again, is that you're going to have... I still do this. It's hard to... I've been opening Pokemon cards up every day for a long time now. It's hard to get... Oh, my God. Bro, literally, I'm completing all the gold cards. Quackaball! We got the Fighting Energy Gold card! Bro, I'm, I'm literally pulling every Secret Rare here. We pulled like four of the Secret Rares out of the six. And it only opened two booster boxes and two ET... Well, four ETBs now, actually. But still, that's still a lot less than when we do some big streams and I'm trying to get all the gold cards. It does not happen like that. Ever. I almost want to say the... the okay, I gotta stop calling. I don't know what we call them here. But the three gold, the three gold star and the two gold star rarities... I feel like they're pretty much on point for the same pull rate. That's kind of what I'm feeling. But we'll see. That's what it seemed like. Hello, Mama La Toad School, Beach Court, Sandaconda, Katie, Primeape, Slow. Ah, but you guys let me know what you think about this down below in the comment section. We got one last pack here. Let's see if we can end this 
with one more big pull. Either way, though, I'm happy with all the cards we got. I think it's pretty cool. Tarkul. Great Tusk EX. We do get one more pull. Oh, there's a code card. All right, guys, but that is going to do it. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you want more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you on the next one.